wouldn't you say clamshell bras are the best? Looking around me, you'd think, sure, I could tap that. But as you know, I'm a merfolk, and so I'm a fish down below. You want great human looks? I've got half. But who cares? No big deal. I want more. I consider myself pretty open-minded. I just might fucking mermaid. Alright. <laughs> I once had a fish, bitch! <laughs> that's the story yeah, I was telling my grandkids. Where, uh... I was eating cornbread. She gets a tattoo on... <laughs> The inside of her thigh, and the guy says, "What's that?" She says, "It's a sea lion," and he says, "I don't get it." And she says, "Well, you put your ear to it, and you can smell the ocean." <laughs> um. So anyway, I've got a question. Yes. Okay. Okay. Oh. Wait. Like, is it? Oh. I've got a question. I've got a question. I've got a question I like to talk about. Okay. Well, I'm um, waiting for you guys to pay attention. Okay, go ahead. Because it requires your time. Okay. Shoot. This is the dilemma right here. That's the. Can you read that out loud? You are alone on an uninhabited island. Which of these would you choose as your companion? The first one is a traditional mermaid with the top half human, and B is the reverse mermaid with the bottom half human. You know what I would do? I would take the top half human because the bottom half. Yes, it's a vagina, but the top half won't have any babies, and every time I'm horny, I can have it shut the fuck up. Just fuck her in the mouth. Just, exactly, just fuck her in the mouth. When she's bothering me, I'll fuck her in the mouth. When I want pleasure, I'll fuck her in the mouth. My dick will be in that bitch's mouth all the time, and no one's having babies. I agree. I don't have to fuck a clit. I don't have to tickle a clit. I you can, you can play it. Exactly. You don't have to work nothing down there. Yeah. You don't have to please her. You don't have to find the G-spot. I don't mind coming on a fin. Right. We'll just come on her fins. Come on her scales. <laughs> you know, and that's what you're supposed to do. It, that's the problem. you got to be careful where you splash on her, where you splash your cum on her, because... Uh, she might release her her little egg sacs. Ah, oh, that's what fish do, right? Yeah. She'll spray the eggs, and then and then you, if you jack off onto the sperm, or the sperm onto the eggs, then then you fuck, because then you got hundreds of babies, right? Oh fuck! Right, think about that, right? But would no. you rather? Do you really want to kiss a fish lip bitch with like a vagina, or see a bottom half well, you see, mermaid with like the what top we have half here of a beautiful woman? Is is a metaphor uh -huh. for 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 life. Because in life you got the chicks that are too good to be true, you know, pretty as can be, but you can't get with them. <laughs> Whereas their friend to the left, the butt nasty one, <laughs> yeah, right, that who basically says fish legs, uh, uh, you know, they their legs are spread wide uh, open. Yeah, they they get the ugly as dog, but that grits my eels. Hmm? That's true. Mm. That's life. That's true, and they'll spread their legs for you. This is a good one. But then you have Girls are like parking spaces. Fish. All the good ones are taken and the only one left are the handicap. Good point. Good point. That's... I don't know. It happens. 